Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Minecraft 1.6.4 Magic World 2 Episode 26. Now there was quite an unfortunate dilemma. There was quite an unfortunate thing that happened last episode. I lost everything. Basically everything. Anything that was not soul bound is gone. That was in my inventory. Why do you ask? Because there is a lovely glitch involving these things and the blood altar. If, let's say, you are living and presume dead after ritualistic practices, another reason why it's kind of forbidden, um, you'll get stuck between death and life and you will lose all your items because they do not drop. Technically, since, the end, since Minecraft believes you're still alive, you still hold all the items. But, since Minecraft knows you have died, you lose all your items. So they do not drop because technically they drop during the the return to spawn point scene or they or and but it was going through the phases so now literally I have nothing I have lost my one of my thumb and amicons. I have lost my m stronger blood orbs I have lost everything of the sort so it is time to get back I've also lost all my spells the only things I have not lost is anything that was soul bound, which I am happy about because if I lost that robe of the stratosphere, I would have been mad. So as you can see, what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to go back into thaumaturgy, we're going to have to go back into the things that I have lost. Now yes, life's a bitch, but hey. Now as you can notice, I've been a bit stuffy as of late. My girlfriend's mother, yes I'm being, I'm, uh, Asked me if I cussed her in my videos because her younger sis brother it wants to watch them. I told her a little bit only when I'm angry. That is a lie. Because from now on, I, I want to be a little bit more free. I feel stuffy and I don't like feeling stuffy. I like being myself. I mean, I do like to do what I do and I cannot find my freaking thermonomic. Oh, did I lose all of it? I had multiples because of accidents. Apparently we've lost that one. So basically, we're gonna delve into even more of this bloody mod. Oh, I even lost the thingy. <laughs> basically, we're getting back into the old gist of things. We've lost literally everything. So why not make it better as it is? As you can see, we can delve into... Oh. There's a new version of Thom um, Thomcraft, by the way, that involves clicking. So you just saw me click a wood one, yeah. As I did, did, just did. Now, because we have lost all of our magical essences, right? Everything. I want to start, well, not with a silverwood wand. I want to delve in with a blood wound, a blood core wand, which also includes alchemy caps. So we're going to actually go into even better of the things. Now, unfortunately, though, that still requires that we make self-sacrifice runes. So let's get into it. Now, self-sacrifice runes, blah, 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 same thing. Told you what you told you. Self-sacrifice runes, expensive as heck. Does actually require a apprentice orb, so we're going to have to remake that with an emerald, unfortunately. We're also going to have to remake our um, thing, our sacrificial altar, um, our knife. Where the heck? Okay, that's there. Um, also, this bloody inventory. I have no clue how that's going. What the heck was that? Why do I have cobblestone notches? Oh, that's right. I was building um, the thing in the old world. How is that world doing? <laughs> Am I completely out of glass? Okay, no, not completely. I can. I think I can scrape up a few blocks of glass. One. Oh, no, I didn't. Okay, I'm good. I'm about to say, if I lost that boar, there was going to be heck. Heck. Hell. Hell, hell, heck, nether. Okay, I've done this wrong. What do I do? Okay, I'm a, a, a thumb. Or I can't spell. So let's go to blood magic. Blood magic. A thumb. Sacrificial life. Oh, I need iron. That's not new. I'm more like I just didn't notice. Iron. Right. Where is it? Here it is. Now, with everything that's been going on, it sucks. 
I'm sick of the fact that I've died twice, losing all- Well, I didn't die once. L well, I did die twice because of this magic. Once, I lost all my stuff inside my bag, which was including stuff to make more Ikerium items. And then secondly, I lost everything at once. <sighs> now, this... We could try it, but there'd be, there'd be no point in my opinion. Now, it does require 50,000 to actually fill it up. So that's why you know it's all of a sudden, whoa. Now, you can still die by accident because of regeneration if we do, if we get too close. So that's going to be interesting on its own. So let's hope we don't. But now I need to make another apprentice orb. And I also hopefully... Are, are they working? They should be ma giving me... Uh, they're doing their best. I, need, I might need to make a whole glowstone section. Now, unfortunately, because we did die... We have also lost our nether farm, our wither farm, I mean. Because technically I didn't know anywhere that was, and I, did, I forgot completely where the hole is to get up there. So now that we have lost it, we're going to have to find a new way to do it. So, okay, I'm just going to let my hearts go down to three, because like, oh, can. Like heck, I'm going to allow my hearts to die, but we've completely lost the wither farm. Which means now it's a problem, and on its own. Even though, you know, right now, we're technically, we're cutting our wrists. That's not a problem at all. Wow. Come on, you can do it. I just keep it going. The thing is, though, to make that master orbit takes so much to get through and done with. So, we can make speed runes, though, I believe, right now. Unless I need to set up my reed farm again. I think I lost all my reeds in during the death, actually. Give it a second. If it needs more, we can actually top it up when we get all the health back. Okay, I think I want to make speed runes, because that's another thing, so that we can be quick about it. So now that we have our another apprentice orb, let's go ahead and reform. Oh, did we? Oh, we lost our minor one. Forgot! Mm hmm Sakes. We've lost everything because of this bloody mod. Ow, my neck. Ugh. Now we need to get another division sill gel. Because like heck, I want... Uh, <laughs> uh, for God's sakes! Now, now I do warn you, um, I don't know how this is going to play out. I mean, I'm getting sick of the loveliness of losing things. Oh wait, the Division Sigil needs a... Uh, for God's sakes. The Division Sigil needs... Sand. So we should go get some sand. And the one thing I lose... I don't lose the hoe. No. No, I lose the shovel. Because it was in my bag. That's right. I lose the shovel. Which it was a really good shovel. But now I need to go with a makeshift crap shovel. For now. Oh wait, I've got glass there. whoop de doo Right. Swiggity swag. I could go over here. Now, I don't think I've taught you the beauty of right no it doesn't work but that's why I, I was gonna teach you the beauty of shift click or I did it wrong apparently the shift click on any eye does not work right now how much LP do we have we still have all that LP okay I'm fine with this right now we need to make speed runes which just requires a little bit extra of those which I'm not going to kill myself again. I'm going to be very careful. And it also requires the runes basically off there and loads of sugarcane. Problem is though, I don't think I have any sugarcane left from dying. Because I... No, no, I, I've got sugarcane left. Okay, so the first point in the matter is actually making a sugarcane portion. So what we're going to do is we're going to make the upper portion sugarcane. All eight squares up top are going to be sugarcane. Second tier here is going to be blood, well, all um, self-sacrifice runes. And the idea underneath it is, ho is preferably the rune of capacity, the augment capacity. Which does require a magician's blood orb, which I think we've lost. Which was, which one's the magician's? How do we make that you? How do I make you again? Raw store. Yeah. How do I make you? Because master blood orb requires 
Oh, we're making the Magician's Blood Orb. I still need to make a Master's Blood Orb. I'm still far away from it. Because we still have to make it efficient. No, actually, it's at the highest tier. So we're going to actually skip the Magician's Blood Orb. Well, we're going to have to make it anyway, but I'm going to skip that. We're going straight to the Magician... The, ma the Master's Blood Orb. Oh, no. No, no. I... I have lost my slivers of blood. Yep. I just realized that. Well, I can continue to search, but I, I believe we have lost the sl slivers of blood. Uh, is that more work for us? God, how do I get this? I'll find out. I think there's a special kind of uh, enchantment or something. Here it is. Demonic blood shard requires a master orb. An imbued slate will make s a few more. Okay. Oh, man. Right. That puts a dent in our plans for now. Especially involving blood magic. Because we need that. So it's time to start searching again. We're going to need paper. We have more than enough paper. But we're going to have to figure out how to make a witchwood wand then. I'm no longer delving into Thalmcraft itself. If I'm going to practice forbidden arts, I might as well start doing the stuff that seems fun. Well, seems. That's the key word here, guys. Seems. Because this is not fun. I don't. I literally sat here thinking, why do I play this game? Why do I. It's. Uh, 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 why? And I realized because it's fun. And then I realized, no, it's not fun. I go build stuff. Well, technically that's fun, isn't it? Okay, a witchwood wand. Let's see how we make this. Arbor. Okay, that's perfectly fine. You get to see, actually, me do things. So why'd I say, but this, this, how is this fun? Really, how is it fun? Because this is not fun. It's really kind of a chore. By the way, I prefer, I do prefer this method compared to the old method of actually the new method of how you actually um, get stuff through, through thumb, thumbcraft. Actually, I think that will reach. Will that reach? We have a more than enough arbor to waste, by the way. That will reach. It was not meant to reach that, but okay. Now, as you can see, this is this is actually thumbcraft's system of actual movements. This is how we actually build things in Thalmcraft. This is how we find the research to do things. This is the movements. I think I've never shown you how to do this on camera besides the nighter. So we've got all that. Now I think since it's mag magic, it requires a touch of magic. Now sometimes, even though this technically can be end up being fruit fruitless. So, now I'm thinking about using the Icorium caps on this one. Which, guess what? We've lost the Icorium caps. God darn it! My Icorium caps are gone. I'm gonna have to make Thomic caps. I'm pro. Oh, I have to do it. Uh, uh, this is daily life for me. Disappointment and unhappiness. Come on, you. Work. Right. Now what we do, we still do have, though, our golems, which is, an, uh, which is a happy thing. We've got our little golems. We've got our little people. So, it's nice to have our little people still. So now that we have learned how to make a witchwood wand, which is actually ties into the great... Ars Magica, which as you can see it's a lot cheaper than that. By creating a wand core out of which wood you discovered a way to convert in mana into vis or V. The witchwood co wand core holds up to 100 vis and will gradually charge itself at a cost of 150 mana per point. Further research will reveal ways to lower this price which is also known as a vitium cap. So let's go ahead and I bet you anything that Vidium Cap requires a touch of magic. Educational. Get a job. No. Educational. Consumption. Wait, well, how, how bad was this one? Uh, no. I'm going to have to burn these now. Uh, 
Okay, we're good for now. We just have to make a Witchwood Core. Right, so what does this Witchwood Core require? It requires a White Rune, a Black Rune, Water Essence, Fire Essence, Earth Essence, Air Essence. Okay, a Purified Vidium Dust and Arcane Ash with a Witchwood Log, which doesn't require much of the bottom either. Now the problem is we have to figure out how to make the bloody other thing. So, f Essences. Ready? Right. We have air essence, we have fire, okay, to make fire we need arcane ash, which I forgot how to make. How the heck do we make arcane ash? I forgot how to. Uh, uh, I need more glowstone. Glowstone is a... What? It is a... Mother ducker to get... I'm still trying not to cuss, I know it's terrible. I know. I think I have more older viewers anyway, but... It's it's a me. It's a me thing. I know. I judge myself. It's terrible. Redstone. Right. We need stone. Oh, please tell me there's stone. So this would be pretty awesome. I mean, it holds 100 vis and it's a lot cheaper in my opinion than, than um... Well, it depends on how cheapness you think of. Because technically, in the words of Thomcraft, if you're doing mining by this point, you'd be just bathing in vis shards. But, um... No, I forgot how to make arc. Are you still? You're actually working. This is shocking. Vitium, vitium. Come on, you. I'm gonna need you. Um, I don't know what I need to have to figure out with the video. Okay, what is video? Like, can we scan video? Oh, I've lost my scanner as well. This is why I made about three, by the way, because somehow when they got in my inventory, I just lose them almost instantaneously. So, yeah, we've got my scanner now, which forbidden magic I think actually adds. No, it doesn't. Then why add objects if you're not gonna add aspects to the objects? Hmm. Cause like this is like envy and jealousy and insecurity. Yes, envy, jealousy, insecurity. Whoop de do. Right. Where in the heck? Okay, over here. Arcane ash, here we go. So we've got this, we've got that, we've got these. Now this will make us Okay, maybe not. I think it arcane ash. Oh, well. I bet you anything it requires something I don't have right now. Look at that. Come on. I know I have some somewhere. There's one there. Nine. Right. Nine. Never mind. Not one. Haha. <laughs> right. Are you sure you don't work? I think you, you do work. Thank you. We're going to make two of you. I want to... That's got soul bound on it. Where do I find that? Does it say open with a shift click? That has soul bound on it. Where do I find that? I want it. I want all of it. Now I think I should have some mimicry left over. A little bit of mimic, right? A little bit. Somewhere in this system, there is a touch, a sliver, a tad of mimicite. There it is. Because I want to get the most out of I can at this arcane ash. We do not want to lose the amount of arcane ash we have to make. Okay, good. Now, from Arcane Ash, we're going to need Blaze Powder. If I bloody even know where the Blaze Powder is. <laughs> uh, okay, Blaze Rods. Okay, we need coal after that. Coal. Two coal. We're going to have to make extra anyway because it is got a little bit of an insecurity to it. Um, Water Shaw. Okay, Water Essence. Do we Did we keep that on us? No, because I just saw it. Okay, water essence. Did we keep the air essence on us then? Because if we did, I can make some more just in case. I don't know if we kept the air essence on us or not. Ah, uh, not in there. Nope. Nope. I swear I feel like I've left it in one of these books. I mean, these places. Yeah, more likely I'm skimming right over it. I don't see it at all. Um, Vidium Dust, you're coming with me. Right, there's no air essence in there. No air essence in there. Nope. 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 Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Why does it feel like it's in this one? No, it's not. It was something it would, if it was in somewhere, it would be in there. It looks like we have to rebuild all the essences. Well, we've got ender es I mean, we've got ender essence here, but that's because it's me. Right. Okay, so there's. Let's actually just go to Ars Magica itself. It's time just to open that mod up and keep an eye on that. Now that we've got that, we also need a 
Water essence we have. Earth essence requires dirt, a little bit of obsidian. Dirt. Stone, which I have in my inventory. A touch of obsidian. A touch of obsidian. A touch of a where the hell is my obsidian? Oh, that's block that's what? That is is that what I have one. Okay, I better not I better have more than one here. Come on, really? None? I mean I remember I had like okay, thank you. Okay, didn't come with me. Thank you. Okay, now that's earth essence. Now how do we make that? Is there anything that needs to be its intermediary? Arcane ash. Okay, air essence. Tama root. That one seems a bit expensive. So let's go ahead and get that one done as well. We have to find the Tama root. Wherever it may shalt be. Shant. Shant. I like that word. Shant be. Shanty. Shant be. Shantanti. Shadanti. Shadamoranti. Oh, I like that. Right. Where's my Tama root? I remember I had loads of it. Well, I didn't mean I wouldn't say loads. I wouldn't say I was rolling in Tama root, but I do say I had a good bit of it. Okay, we've got a lot, more, a lot of shadow ink. Wow. I mean, if we have to rebuild our spells, we have enough ink, we have enough books. Which, uh, I have to rebuild my spells, and I don't have most of the books, because most of them died with the old age, the old world. Uh, no. Okay, it's like, more likely it's staring me in the face and I'm looking over it. So... Oh no, we've got two. We've only got two. That's fine. Just two. I'm more likely I'm going to go kill the air guard. I cannot teleport there, but I can fly now. So we'll fly up there, take off all my armor, because more than likely he's going to try to beat me. And then um, I'll get some more air essence off him. So last thing is we got the stuff for the fire. We've got water essence. If we need more water essence, go kill the water guardian. So let's go ahead and start having those two go, and then I'll actually end the episode. So what I'm going to do is first, I'm going to actually see if this works, if I did this right. Might have to make a tad bit more arcane ash. We'll find out. You'll notice this thing move. Okay. You. You're doing good. I think I've got some stored in here. Oh, I've lost everything. That's right. Forgot. Sakes. Okay, never just care. Okay. Actually, we're not ending yet. Yes, I just hit the mic. We're not ending yet. There's a thing that will always be helpful to me. It might not be big, but it'll be worth it. Okay, great. Let's go ahead and grab these. Right, we've got blaze powder here. We've got the rods here. We've got the obsidian inventory. We need ender pearls, and ender pearls are always part of me. I've got loads of ender pearls as it is. Right, so we've got that. Now I just need a tad bit of wool, which comes from... We've got loads of these. So let's go ahead and make this. It's time to bloody have a system where we don't have to worry about that. Now, I've only shown you... Okay, come on, I had all the ingredients I needed, I bet you I need... Oh, I do not have a chest. Right. Because I... I my inventory gets full, quickly. It does. So, it is time to make a thing. You already know about beautiful, 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 ender storage by Chicken Bones, I believe. Okay, well, he adds another thing. It's called an ender pouch, which is basically ender storage that connects to the pouch form. Now, uh, you have no clue what I'm talking about. Well, we need leather for this, which I think I left all my leather over in the area over there. So, we don't need obsidian for this, but I needed the obsidian and that. What, I think I put something I needed in there. Yeah, ender pearls. Um, get rid of another rock. We don't need that. Okay. We need leather. I think... Oh, okay, I've got loads of leather here. Never mind. Okay, so go basically open this, grab this, and then literally ender pouch. Now, what does this do? Let me show you more specifically. See that over there? Over there? Yeah, that opens. This is a pouch which connects to the ender storage system, but the problem is we've already got a white system that will automatically dump into here, which is for my farming purposes. So what is this one going to be? What are we going to put in the corner here? Well, we have, like I told you, we have loads of shadow ink. Absolutely crap tons of shadow ink, which I forgot where it is. Loads of shadow ink. So how do we change the colors? Simple. You change little cotton strips on the top. This will make it a different system. So if you notice that when I open this bag, okay, that doesn't open. The reason is, is because it's part of a different chain of combinations. You can have as many combinations, one of you will suss it out for me, hopefully. I don't know how to do this though, like, I don't know how to dye this bag itself. 
like uses. There's no way to die this bag. Absolutely no way. There must be a way to die this bag still. <laughs> Is there no way to die the bag? Oh wait, no, I remember. I remember. Where's the bag? Okay. In order for you to die the bag and to set it to a location, you actually have to go over to this thing, click it. This is now a complete back black bag that only opens to that. So from now on, when my inventory is full, oh, it's bigger. No, it's not. It's the same. Now that my, when my inventory is full, and let's say I don't have space for things, and I really want to make space, now I actually do have a space that's reliable, like a safe. A really good safe. Um, by the way, if someone were to open this, that is not you. They'll have their own black, black, black network. As like a, a white here is enough, a, a white, white, white network, which I'm actually planning on switching to green, 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 because, you know, it's it's it is nature. I just want to have that diversity. So, I do hope you enjoyed this episode, to Gate guys. I am sorry for the whole shit, shit, crap, shit, fuck. Oh, I dropped the f bomb there. Oh well. The problem is, I did lose all my stuff, all of it, as in. I know I could spawn it back. I know I could make an excuse like, oh, look, my stuff's over there. No. I have not cheated once during this season. Which means I'm being a good boy. And I'm still not going to cheat. Trust me, if I would have lost that, I'll be honest, I would have cheated. I mean, that's that's the role of the stratosphere. I'm, I'm going to freaking cheat for that. But we're going to make those all green so that we can actually have... There we go. A system. And which they'll still be connected to, by the way. But I'm not cheating. Y'all don't like it when people cheat? I don't like it when people cheat because I don't understand. I mean, I'll cheat for testing, but I won't cheat for cheat cheat. <laughs> so, it's cool to become a god your own way without cheating. So, I'm going to let all my stuff burn in the depths of the nether and more likely fall into the deep dark. It's time for me to start anew. Unfortunately, I was getting stuffy, and more likely my punishment in itself was because I was getting powerful. And now I'm knocked down to my knees. By the way, if you think this is a storyline idea, no, it's not. I, uh, that was a fucking mistake. This is just playing off. I'm, I'm playing it off. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make all the stuff we need for the essences off camera. I'm going to kill the air guardian, hopefully get another floaty float thing, and then we'll have that to go. So then we'll start off from there. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Until next time, guys. Ta-ta. Never mind. I found my air, sh air senses are right here, so we'll be making it next episode. Ta-ta. Magic flows through the air. Knowledge stored like a caring prayer. Aura condensed into a node. Forbidden arts stronger than showed. I am Shadok Star, your loyal host. Like and subscribe to spread this ancient boast.